No Film School's coverage of NAB 2017 is brought to you by Blackmagic Design, amazing solutions for film, post-production, and television. Vimeo, the new home for 360 video. Learn more at vimeo.com 360. And My Road Reel, presented by Road Microphones. Back with more categories, more chances to win, and over $500,000 worth of prizes. Hey, this is Charles Hain for No Film School. I'm here at NAB Show 2017, talking to Les from Cook. How are you doing? I'm doing all right. About the brand new S7s that were just released weeks ago, right? Uh, a week ago. A week ago. Yeah. So tell me about what we're seeing here. Well, you know, there are a, a, new, cook li- a new cook line of lenses made for the new forthcoming full frame and beyond uh, cameras. This is actually, we call it full frame plus because we're beyond the 24 by 36 frame. Uh, the minimum image circle is 46.31, which equates to the open gate on the new, the new weapon Vista Vision camera. Oh, so that's a huge image circle for a cook, but it's all coming out of the back of a standard PL mount? It's all coming out of a standard PL mount at T2. T2 consistent throughout the line? Throughout the line, all eight lenses from 18 up to 135. And what sort of price point are we looking at for these? Low 20s. Low 20s each? Each, yes. Gotcha. And we also, you know, we're showing it here this year, the Pancro Classics. Oh, so tell me about the Pancro Classics. Yes, well, you know, the, the old speed Pancros have become enormously popular. And we've just taken those old designs, we've updated them to modern glasses, and we're remaking them. So later this year, you'll be able to get a, a set of lenses in with modern glass, modern housings, and PL mounts that look just like the old Speed Pancros. And so these are Pancro Classic and they're all slash eye yeah. accessible, so you can shoot a vintage look but still get all your metadata for visual all the effects. metadata, and they're all very similar to the other Cook lenses, so the old cam focusing, nice marks, and you know, because the old Speed Pancros are this big. So if you love the look of some old, like Gordon Willis was obviously a big Speed yeah. Pancro fan. Yeah. So if you're a big Gordon Willis fan and you're doing a project and you really want to capture the look of those old lenses, you can now rent or even consider purchasing yeah. a set of the Pancros that are going to give you modern optical response, but in a with a vintage feel. That's right. And you can get parts and service on them. Are those shipping now? They will start shipping over the summer. And what's the price point? About 9100 each. That's less at the Cook booth here at NAB Show 2017. They've got two new lines of glass, which, like, frankly, is like a plethora of riches. They've got the Pancro Classics, which are recreating the old Speed Pancro looks that Gordon Willis loved. And then they've got the S7, which are covering VistaVision and, like, open gate. So there's a whole lot of image circle coverage as sensors move bigger. If you're considering a set of lenses that you really want to be sure I'm going to get 20 years of life out of, the S7s, with all of that coverage at the back, are really something to look at. So I think we can all agree larger sensors are definitely the future of it, filmmaking, even at the indie level. For No Film School 20, at NAB Show 2017, this is Charles Hayne.